Tyler here with Alan Smith. Hello to you all and welcome to today's game. Our match today, Barcelona, and they play Real Madrid. There are plans to take leagues, uh, we've seen it in other sports, to take a domestic game into another country. But with spectacles like this, you can understand the other countries wanting to grasp this, and if a, the opportunity comes along, I'm sure they'll take it with both hands. I'm sure they would, I mean, they can't get enough of it on the TV. Uh, we'll just look at it, we can see it first hand, but uh, let's hope that kind of interest continues. Well, the players have very little margin for error today in one way, because we've got a referee who is very, very letter of the law. Takes no prisoners, does he? And uh, I think in some matches it can be good, but the managers should have made that clear in the dressing room, made sure that the players don't dive in early doors. Half started by Real Madrid. Ronaldo. So this will be a corner for Real Madrid. Here's a chance for a breakaway. They were defending a corner a few seconds ago. Good pass. Strength needed to hold off the opponent. What a chance! Still in play here. Excellent block by the defender. So this will be a corner for Real Madrid. And it's a headed effort at goal. Oh, off the crossbar and behind for a goal kick. Barcelona, there is almost a national pride. They do actually have their own country team. They play perhaps once or twice a year, Catalonia. And the Barcelona players feel almost obliged to turn out for them, even though they have enough top matches of their own. But it emphasizes that it's a special part of the world, football-wise, and in terms of Spanish politics as well. Well, that's right, yeah. I mean, the language is a little different, and the football they play at times is a little different. It can be on another planet to their competitors. Great when it's on full form. So this will be a corner for Real Madrid. Corner into a decent area, but nothing quite happening. Real Madrid have the ball. That was a very well-timed tackle. Cesc Fabregas. Angel Di Maria. Now Messi. Intercepted the play, saw the pass coming. They've got the ball back, Barcelona. Xavi. Playing a pass is one thing, but having the vision to see it is another. And he's got all those qualities. Gone wrong, really, from a promising position, and they've lost possession. Mesut Özil, Angel Di Maria. Now it's Puyol for Barcelona. Can he turn away from the challenge here? 
Pepe. Well, they're widening their play here out to the winger, Pepe. Xabi Alonso. Fabio Coentrao. Well executed. And the defenders on top. The throw in for Real Madrid. Here's the cross. That will only run to the opposition. That wasn't the idea when the cross came in. We know with Barcelona that their best is brilliant. They might just have to be at their brilliant best today. Yeah, and I don't think they're going to see quite as much of the ball as they normally do, and they've got to adjust to that. Good forward play. What a chance here. Iniesta changing pace now, giving the defenders plenty to think about. Coentrao, Karim Benzema, and it's Barcelona back on the ball now. Now Fabregas, Xavi, Sergio Busquets keeps it going well. Ricardo Cavallo makes the tackle. He's gone in very fairly and won the ball cleanly. The tackle to get possession and maybe change the emphasis of the game. They can get forward now. Iniesta. Something could be on here. Barcelona winning a corner. Opponents have got the ball. Marcelo. Fabio Coentrao. Marcelo. Angel Di Maria. Benzema. He's pinched it back again. Good pass. Keeps it going. Oh, a nice idea with that through ball, but in the end it wasn't quite accurate enough. So there we are, half-time. The two teams here have got a lot of potential to play better than this. Yeah, they're trying to find highlights on the big screen, but it's not lasted very long, that package. Some of the supporters still making their way back at the start of the second half here in the new Camp. Danny Alves. Here's Fabregas. And that was the defender. Excellent. Xavi Alonso. Angel Di Maria. Karim Benzema. Into his feet. Return to Ronaldo. This is good work by the attacking team. They just can't find a way through yet, but they're still keeping the ball. And a good piece of tackling here. Real Madrid given the throw here, but we're going to have a change now. And the manager trying something different in the hopes of getting his team in front. Mesut Ozil. Fabio Coentrao. He's gone behind for a goal kick.
Messi. Fabio Coentrao. Mesut Ozil. The tackle from Puyol. Mesut Ozil. Angel Di Maria. Benzema. He's made the save. It's still in play here. He's really whipped it into the middle. The defender has dealt with the cross well. Intercepted by Xabi Alonso. It's pretty easy for the defender to deal with that, but he did his job. He's going to cross it. So rather petered out this attack, it's a goal kick. Well, now we are going to have a substitution, and at this stage of the game, it's still level. This is what the manager will hope will be the decisive moment. Iniesta. They've gone and won it, Real Madrid. Cristiano Ronaldo. Mesut Ozil. Angel Di Maria. They've got the ball back, Barcelona. He's put him in here. Teammates arriving for the cross. It's Piquet in with the tackle. Barcelona defending this corner. And they've lost possession of the ball now. And across comes Sergio Ramos. Great place to win it back. Oh, the cross has gone straight to the man at the back. And it's Barcelona back on the ball now. Ball still alive. Played by Ricardo Cavallo. It's a throw in for Barcelona. David Villa. Cesc Fabregas. Good ball. Not the best defending you'll ever see today, Martin, that's for certain. They've got the ball back, Barcelona. Here's Mascarano. Cesc Fabregas. The ball with Abidal. Real Madrid have the ball. Angel Di Maria. will be a goal kick. And the ball now with Pepe for Real Madrid. Angel Di Maria. Here's Alonso. Sergio Ramos. Play back to Javi Alonso. Angel Di Maria. Benzema. Super pass. Good opportunity. Absolute cracker of a match. The scores are still close. It could still go either way. And that has gone out of play with the deflection. The throwing for Real Madrid. So we're going to see a double switch now. Ronaldo. Mesut Ozil. Sergio Ramos. Well, sometimes nerves get the better of players, and maybe, Alan, that was one such case. Yeah, I think so. It just goes to show everybody's human. Sergio Ramos, Angel Di Maria. Alonso on the ball.
Barcelona get the throw, but we're still level here, and we're going to have a substitution. Is this the way to alter the match in their favour? Real Madrid given the throw here. And he's got possession in his own penalty area. Opportunity. Great goal for Barcelona. Fantastic moment for them. Game on now. All eyes on the clock now for Barcelona. They've got this late goal and uh, time is on their side. Well, just when it seemed to be headed for stalemate, a moment of brilliance. Oh, he's going to be the hero there, isn't he, if his team win this match. What a strike. Barcelona are ahead. <laughs> Now, Gary Alonso. Nuri Sahin. Gonzalo Higuaín. Barcelona have done it, there is the final whistle, they've won this game. A great result which they managed from this very, very late goal. Yeah, and I thought the losing team were beginning to tire towards the end, maybe the concern for the manager needs to work on the fitness. That's the end of what has been a fabulous contest between these two teams. From Alan Smith and myself, Martin Tyler, goodbye for now.